everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hi, I'm Brie. We're back with Dominic and some waters. Oh yeah. Today we're going to compare some of the more expensive waters to see what all the hype is about. It's just water, but they're all different prices. So we are going to see who has the most expensive water and which one we think tastes the best. Yeah. So right now we have them down here. We have five laid out. We have Evian, Smart Water, Core, I don't know how to say this. This one's new to me. Wakei, Wakei, it's Hawaiian, I butchered that. And then <laughs> Fiji. Oh yeah. I feel like that's the more expensive water that everyone loves. Like that you'll always hear about. Yeah. They're like, I need my feet. We just have filtered Breda water, so that's how fancy we are with water. Honestly, I think that's so. the best out of all the ones that I've tried. Me too. I like it Breda tastes the most. great. Probably gonna stick with Breda unless we get changed here. So let's see. Right now we have them from least expensive to most expensive, and then I've written on my handy dandy sticky note what amount per ounce they cost. I did some math and that was painful. It was painful. It was. She was paying the whole entire time. I hate math. So this one is one and a half liters, which is 50.7 ounces. For this whole thing, it was $2.28 per ounce. It is four and a half cents an ounce. We're just gonna taste it, get the experience of the bottle. Okay, it just tastes like, it's not as like crisp, but it, Tastes smooth. It's not bad. It it does yeah. taste like just spring water. Yeah. Like it's kind of nice. Nice. It's nice. Clean water. It's That's refreshing. Good. Yeah. Good. Not like any weird taste or anything mm -hmm. like that. Okay. So that was Evian. Smart water. I've had smart water. I've had smart water often. before too. I like it. Okay. So smart water is one quart. So it is 1.8 fluid ounces. For this whole thing, it was one dollar and sixty-eight cents. Per ounce, it is five cents an ounce. I feel like that one has like a slight taste that goes away maybe, but it's also really clear. That one tastes a little more irony. Maybe that's what it is. I think it tastes like it's got stuff in it. But doesn't it have like added stuff in it, tells you? Calcium chloride, magnesium chloride, vapor distilled water, what does this okay. one say? Electrolytes for taste natural spring water so that okay. makes sense you can taste the other stuff in this one i actually kind of prefer the first one you know i, I just like a generic water taste just you know clean. just like a clean water. yeah i don't need additives in my water no so i mean but i guess that could be what smart water is trying to get at yeah okay next up is core water 30.4 fluid ounces for the whole thing it was one dollar 58 cents Per ounce, it is 5.2 cents an ounce. So it's a lot more clear again. I feel like it's. Again, I feel I, I can have taste a little the bit of a taste now. I can taste like the electrolytes or whatever they put in it. But it's purposeful, which is yeah okay for me because I know what they're adding. Magnesium chloride, calcium chloride, same potassium stuff bicarbonate as this, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much the same thing. They do taste pretty similar. Yeah, a little bit more clear maybe, but. I kind of like the bottle, like it's kind of a cool bottle and it's the cap cool is like huge, so that's nice. I like the blue. Okay, I'm really excited for the next one. I've never seen this one before. It's the bottle color, but <laughs> look at this guy. I wish it was blue like that. That'd be pretty cool. Wayeke, Wayeke, Hawaiian volcanic water, naturally alkaline electrolytes, deep well water. Ooh. It is one liter, so it is 33.8 fluid ounces. This one is $1.98 for the whole thing. Per ounce, it is 5.9 cents an ounce. Getting up there again. 5.9 cents an ounce, and that yeah. one was 5.2? Yes. That looks so cool. It kind of tastes like the Evian one a little bit more, like a little bit more like pure. That one's, yeah, I agree. I think that one's pretty good too. I still I like, like the Evian the most out of all of these. That one does, like a little, I don't know, like fresh? It, yeah, it just tastes like water fresh. that you just drink out of a stream that's clean. I know that doesn't sound <laughs> clean, but I think. But this is pretty good. This isn't bad though. Yeah. And the bottle's really cool. It's in, for the like price of it, it's nothing where I'm like, oh, I need to go get that one. Yeah, I agree. But so far, like if these were all in a store and I had to buy a bottle of water, I'd get one of those too. I'd either get the Evian or the Hawaiian volcanic one. <laughs> And that sounds cool. <laughs> it's, not neat. it's Hawaiian volcanic water. 
Sorry, I have to go get my Hawaiian volcanic water. I just, I can't do anything about it. And Fiji. I think everyone knows Fiji. Oh yeah. I think most people love Fiji. It is $2.40 for this whole thing. So per ounce, it is 7.3 cents an ounce. And let's go back to our lowest one was 4.5 cents an ounce. Wow. It's like getting up there for what it is. Does that have a taste? A little bit, but it's not as strong as the other ones. No, at first it was like completely pure tasting, but then it kind of has a slight taste. Yeah, it does. I mean, it tastes very clean, you know, compared to the other ones, but mm -hmm. it does have that slight taste. I don't know. I mean, I, I didn't love it, mm -hmm. but I also didn't hate it. I still like the Evian the most. I do too. I don't know what it is. It's just, just tastes the best out of all of them. Made by the French Alps. I'm gonna have to go back to it and try it again. It also could have been just that it was the first one that we tried. And so it was just like a clean like nice. palette. I'm trying to think like what I could down. I really, I don't know. No, this one still tastes just the cleanest out of all of them. That one still isn't bad. The Hawaiian one. Yeah. That one tastes clean. It just, when it sits in your mouth for a second, you can start to taste something, but it's not bad. I mean, all mm. waters have a slight taste to it, but. Besides Brita water. Brita water has like no taste. I know. <laughs> Maybe some people like knowing that there's extra stuff in it or like the taste, but I just like crisp nothingness in my mouth. Yeah. See, I used to drink this a lot too. Yeah. Just like smart water on campus when you'd walk around, just get a bottle of smart water and go. Yeah. But now that I taste it again, I don't really like it compared to the other ones. I like kind of knowing that there's like good stuff in these waters, but also water is already just healthy and I just want water. Mm. So I don't need extra stuff in mine. This one Flavors. just tastes so clear. Maybe it's more expensive to add things to your waters, Maybe. which is why they're more expensive, but I just, I just want like this guy. Look how I know. It's huge. The whole thing. Yeah. But those only have a slight taste. These two are definitely heavier and I don't like these as much. Yeah, I agree. So if anything, I would either just go for the Evian or like if they were sitting out, I like these ones too. If price wasn't a factor, yeah. I'd still go with this one. But like you said, if these were just sitting out, I would take one of them too. All better than Dasani. Oh my gosh, that wasn't even a factor. Not my fave. Okay, so the Fiji and the Hawaiian one have like that cleaner, like crisp taste that I like, mm -hmm. but then it has a slight taste to it after it sits, which I don't, but compared to the rest of the waters, it's way better. And I still get that like refreshing, like crisper taste. Yeah. And this one does slightly taste like tap water, but like a cleaner version of tap water. Not yeah. Weird. Let me know your favorite types of waters. Let me know if you're a Fiji person or if you did get on this train early and you're a Hawaiian volcanic water person or if you like the taste of additives. I'm really curious now, so let me know down in the comments below what you do drink. And thank you so much for being here on my channel. Make sure you give this video a like, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications so you never miss a post. And I'll see y'all next Saturday. Bye.